welcome back to our stupid reactions, idiots. I'm Corbin. I'm ready to react. Rick act. I like it. <laughs> I'm a Rick actor. Ooh. Actor, act, Rick. Yes. Yeah, so yeah. yeah, that's what you do. That was smart, Corbin. <laughs> Please follow us on Instagram! Twitter! For more juicy content! So juicy. Namaste, juicy lady. Namaste, lady of juice. <laughs> <laughs> so today we'll be reacting to a uh, a different video that we've never done. Something new, and something fun, and no, it's not the right words. Uh, but it, it's from one of our patreons. At a certain tier, you can r request whatever you'd like, uh, and we'll react to it. And well, I, with limitations. With limitations. I mean, if you, we're not just gonna react to anything. Yeah. So, but. Um, yeah, I thought it was interesting because we haven't reacted to this, so it's like, uh, amazing. Amazing? I, at first glance, it looks like cinematic, but apparently it's, is it Carnatic music? I don't know. Is it C-A-R-N or C-A-M-A-T? And I think this is the lady, if you can pronounce that. Wow, that's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> and I want to get it right. I don't know that I will. Um, Shemical Priya. Sounds right. Okay. Um, but it's traditional Indian music, uh, and so... I think we, it's Carnatic. We haven't done this before, and so I'm quite excited. I am too. Learn new stuff. That's all one of our favorite things. That's too. very, very true. Here we go. I like the beat already, though. Mm -hmm. That drone. I imagine the drone it well. I'd love to know. She's South Indian. It is Carnatic. There it is. I can see it better. Wow, what a low register. I didn't expect that. I thought it was a dude. Incredible.
Wow, indeed. we could watch that was cool man that was cool so here's the deal um I... <laughs> surprise that'd be a great ringtone <laughs> the uh <laughs> the musical aspects of this are very intriguing to me because i'm so unfamiliar with their the whole eastern music is a completely different world than western music yeah they have different Different scales, Registered. different yeah. everything. Yeah. Uh, Western music, for those of you who don't know, a little music thing. Uh, A440, if you notice that American orchestras will tune at the very beginning of a concert to the note A, which has 440 vibrations per second on that note, and all of the instruments will tune to the A440. Just a reminder, he was a musical theater teacher. Yeah, I was, I was <laughs> and, and we had a... We had a conservatory of fine art, which had theater, music, dance, and visual art, and I oversaw all of those aspects. So the A440 is completely designed for Western music, and there are completely other, totally different modes for Eastern music, and it's much older. In fact, as I was listening to that, the droning reminds me, obviously, of Gregorian chant, but I guarantee that the Asian uh, modalities all predate Gregorian, uh, and that was just freaking cool yeah it's uh and yeah i don't again another instrument that i've seen before but i don't know what it's called the uh really tall long string instrument yeah that yeah i don't know what that one you'll know and you'll let us know uh <laughs> yeah and i've never heard of carnatic music yeah. so i have no idea what carnatic they say carnatic means. music is not from earth R really it's made from gods by gods for uh, gods by gods yeah no then it must it must be purely music that's of a spiritual yeah. nature yeah it's so different from but i love that she kind of did the acapella almost at the beginning and mm -hmm. then she brought in the violin and then she at the end brought in the percussion yeah uh, <laughs> and my my favorite band of all time is the beatles mm -hmm. and i think y'all know if you know the beatles how much india influenced them and the maharishi and uh, as well as somebody um um, oh, goodness gracious, I can't believe I'm having a brain fart on this right now. Uh, oh my goodness, that's going to really make me mad. Mm. He, he completely transformed the Beatles' music. George Harris, they all went and spent time, not just with the Maharishi, but with this legend. Oh, Pedro Eustache is going to be really mad at me. If you don't know who Pedro Eustache is, you should look him up because he's one of the world's greatest wind instrument creators and players, and he played and studied with... I can't believe I'm not getting this in my brain. Oh, I'm really mad. You're a terrible person. I'm really mad right I now. I did really love the <sighs> violinist, if it was a violin, in this piece. Yes. I thought she killed it. <laughs> yeah. I was, yeah. I was wondering why she was holding it down here as opposed to... If I know. If it's just a personal preference or if it's... Um, Ravi Shankar. Good grief, Rick. They all knew it already. <sighs> so I cannot believe my brain wasn't pulling Ravi Shankar out of my head. I feel better now. All, I, all you had to do was Google Indian music legend, and he pops up. Oh, is it? Ravi Shankar. Yeah, do you know? No, I don't know who that oh, is. Oh, Ravi Shankar, dude. Completely transformed the Beatles music okay. and transformed Western music. Mm -hmm. uh, Pedro was able to actually study with Ravi Shankar. Anyway. You know, if there's one here. instrument that I wish I could play, it's the fiddle or the violin. And it, yeah, it's a beautiful instrument. It's, I've always, I always wanted to, and I wanted to as a kid, but we were 
poor. Right. <laughs> money they're expensive. Couldn't... <laughs> My parents couldn't afford that or yeah. the or the lessons that they would take. Right. Um, but that's the one instrument I always wish I would be able to play, even more than like the guitar or the drums. I'd wish I'd be able to play the violin because it's such a beautiful instrument. It's, it's so, so complex and, and expressive. expressive. Yeah. Yeah. Really, of all the instruments, I think they the strings, the violins in particular, capture emotion mm -hmm. and and bring out emotion. So like if you're fiddler. if we're watching a movie where a military dog is killed and it's a solo string instrument on the violin, that'd get you to cry. I wouldn't watch a film where a dog dies. Why would I do that? Why would you put that in film? Like, are you just a monster? 